Hello everyone, my name is Phoenix. And I'm Xandor. And today we will be playing Bloodborne Part 3. The final part for the Long Hunt. Today, hopefully, we will be killing the Cleric Beast and running away. I don't know about running away, but I do want to kill that Cleric Beast. He a big boy. He is a very big, chunky boy. I mean, look look at this. Look at him. He's big. He's almost as big happy. as my hand. Look at that. And not happy. No, he is Without further ado, let's get rolling. From deep within the tomb of Odin, the cleric beast emits a thundering roar. From all around central Yharnam, howls of scourge beasts are heard in turn. It would appear this creature has taken up the role of pack leader, summoning the beast to it. As long as this creature lives, more scourge beasts will be drawn to it. The goal is clear. All right, Phoenix, you are going to have first turn this time. I am going to start moving towards me. Hey, wait a minute. I'm the game master this turn. Oh, look at that. The Odin Chapel right off the bat. Right off the bat. You know, now the whole loss of direction makes sense when it comes to Bloodborne because this is how it feels sometimes, I swear. Oh. What? Okay, so that stuff that we've been getting throughout the campaign mm -hmm. still affects us. We had ominous warnings. Yeah. Read 57. You had mercy. Yeah. Read card 30. Yeah. So these do these cards still affect us throughout. So the we're supposed to hold on to them. Yep. Well then, and uh, don't forget I slayed the little girl. Yes. So we do not have mercy. No. Oh God. Redemption. As you enter Odin Chapel, the familiar sight of the hunter you rescued greets you. He stands reloading his pistol, drawing his weapon. Wait, we rescued a hunter. It was the NPC. Oh, the survivor from the old house. Yes. Okay, okay. No, it was the one that we just did. The one that I took to the Odin's chapel. Oh, that was a hunter. Okay. Mm -hmm. So you've returned. Perhaps I still have some fight left in me. He says, though suddenly gripping his side. Well, perhaps with some assistance. Could put a voice on it. Nope. Place. Hunter First of all, I'm supposed one. to be the GM here because you were GM last game. But I'm practicing my reading skills. So I can read. Phoenix, you're not a child. But I can't read, so I, I do actually need to read practice. Do you reading. actually have dyslexia? Yes. Oh. Place hunters plus one insight tokens on this card. Place one NPC token on the Odin Chapel space. When a hunter moves out of its space, it may be moved with them. Each time the a hunter's mob or a hunter's minion is slain in its space, remove one token from this card. Give me three insight tokens. Now let me read it with a voice. Please. No, we already read it. <sighs> you never let me do anything fun. Do I keep revealing stuff? I say yes. Oh, goody. Was that a hunter's mob? Yep. And this is where I'm gonna stop my turn. Monster's turn. Moves in the same space as us. Basic attack is a two swing. Yep. Two damage, two swing, two two speed. I'm just gonna end it with a four attack deadly thrust. Okay, and that'll kill it. Yep. Give me my that echo and give me my damage. I should refresh my card. 
Yes, you should. Do you have any cards? Oh, wait, you do have that Carol rune. Actually, wait. I automatically dodge it. Okay. Uh, suppose. Uh, so, and does that also get rid of one insight token? Because you killed the hunter's mob with the oh. NPC hunter on you. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and move this way. How do you want the tile? Either way, you've got a scourge beast. Either way, I've got a scourge beast. So let's go ahead and just start dealing with it. And I'm gonna go ahead and hit it with a heavy cleave at speed one. And it is going to hit you with its ability. Okay. For a three damage stagger fast attack. How much? What was it? Three. It's basic. Basic. So stagger, and I hit it for cleave. Uh, three damage. Okay. What you looking at? Just trying to see if uh, th because I'm using my dodge card to attack, does that not take place as well? No. No, it doesn't. No, it does not. You yeah. used it to attack. Yeah. It's only one or the other. Yeah. Are you going to continue combat? Uh... Yeah. I'm going to hit it with an arcing swing at speed 2. It's going to hit you with basic attack for speed 3. Okay. Uh... I, hold two, on, hold you on. take 2 damage. What I'm saying. Hold on. After attack... Mm -hmm. Transform the weapon for free, mm -hmm. which also repeat resolves my repeating pistol. No. Yes. Your attack resolves after it. I know. Let me let me have this. Okay. Anyways, it's dead though. What was the speed of the basic? Three. Three. Okay. So how much damage did it deal to me? Four. Two. Yeah. Yeah. So I have four damage on me, and I have killed. How do you have four? Because it did. Oh no! It only did two. Not bad. And I have killed the Scourge Beast. Meat. Okay. Any other actions? That is all my actions. Think. No monsters on the board. Okay. Ooh, it's my turn. Do I want to do that? Hold on. No, I'll do that later. I was thinking about using my Carol rune. Yes, your turn. I'm going to discard this card to move a space. I'm going to discard a card to loot. And I get a bolt paper. Increases the attack speed by one. Okay. Anything else you want to do? And I'm going to go ahead and start moving into the board. Is that one of the missions we have to get to? Yep. Okay. 49, 50, 51, 52, 53. If you have the ominous warnings, reveal card 54. And that's the one where, where I killed the girl, right? No, this one was the one where we delivered the NPC in the last mission to the church. Hmm. Place two insight tokens on this card. Each time a Scourge Beast is slain, remove one from this card. Does that include the one I just killed? No. No. Give me three inside tokens. Four inside tokens. Four? Why four? Because that's how many there are. It's Hunters plus two. Yeah. 
Good thing it's just us two playing then. Supposedly it gets easier with the more people we have. Um, screw tree songs. Where? Oh. Right here. All the monsters are over by you. <sighs> yeah, you fucked up. Yep. It's gonna move into my space and swing at me. Yep. Two damage. I just take it. I just eat it. Yep. Uh. Four damage. Even as attack is dodge or staggered, Hunter must dodge uh, at speed two for or suffer two additional damage. Okay. That's fine. I'm still good. I'm still standing. Yeah, yeah. Nope. No. No, you're not. You have two wounds left. Anyways, your turn. I'm gonna go ahead and move and spend another card to loot. You got Cold Blood Dew. Nice. And a Blood Echo. Nice. And then I'm going to move one more time this way. Actually, no, this way. Which way? Give me the side with the hunt. Oh, wait, no, it can't be used. Good catch. Can't be used? Nope. Mm. Neither, none of them can be used, so. We're foggy. Yep. Okay, so. And put a fog gate there. Here? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And put a fog gate on the other two. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and here, and here. That's all the fog gates. Okay. Well, just note, we then can't move that. Let's, let's just put a poison tile. Probably. Let me, let me see the rules real quick. Let me, let me see the rules. All right, because somebody forgot to hit the record button. That we're was not Phoenix. Gonna, we're not going to rename names. Phoenix. Yeah, we I forgot to hit the record button, but what essentially just happened is is I hit the scourge beast with a scagger stagger stagger quick lash quick cut doing two damage to it and it was unable to hit me, and then I used a quick or a slash and I increased the speed of it with a lightning paper. So it happened at speed three, and it tried to hit me with something at speed two, so it didn't go off. Yep. So it died. I am going, uh, my turn now? Mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and use my consumable cold blood dew to gain a blood echo. Okay. Then I am going to spend a card to move one, two. Spawning in a hunter's minion mm -hmm. right there. And then uh, I'm going to go ahead and let it come to me. Okay. It's with its basic attack. Okay. The one I'm going to use my repeating pistol to stagger it. Oh, uh, actually, wait. What speed is the basic attack? No, wait. It's still staggered. It still staggers regardless. Doesn't matter. And I'm going to hit him with my rally strike at plus one wound, plus one speed, healing me for two wounds because that's all I have taken, mm -hmm. and dealing three to him. Okay. Mm and then continuing or letting it I'm gonna letting it end. I'm gonna continue it. I'm gonna hit him with a slash at plus one damage. He's gonna hit you with another basic attack. Okay. However, it is going to kill him before it gets to the speed one. Yep. Give me a second blood echo. A third blood echo. Third. I killed the. Oh, yeah, no, because no, I killed you, the Scourge Beach. You spent your blood thing. Your blood pellet. Whatever. Yeah. 
I killed, yeah, killing the two monsters and using the blood do, yeah. Mm -hmm. So I am at maximum blood echoes. I have no mm -hmm. card to go into the dream yet. Uh, and I never got to finish my turn. I asked you it was my turn. I don't remember this. But essentially what's going to happen is I'm going to spend both cards to move one, two, three, four. Okay. Uh, move up the tick by one. Oh. What? No, I'm not going to do that. Why? One, two. There you go. Although the camera might not be able to capture that. Hey, look, it's an nice case clinic. Yoskas. Yoskas. Go ahead and scoot everything. Which way? Back? Good. Okay. Yay. I didn't loot it. Okay. That's two. And also, the, me being in the graveyard, does that trigger anything? Mm, no. No? Okay. It's the Odin's Chapel, the Great Bridge, and Yosuke's Clinic. Okay, so my next so turn. So literally everywhere except for where you are. That's that's BS, but okay. Uh, but that just means next turn, go into the chapel. Card number 45. If you have both Yosuke's Research and Safe Rest, huge Yosuke's Clinic. Oh god. I gotta look back. I know the Safe Rescue to, to the Clinic is not one we've got. Surviving the Hunt. Duel, du no, we don't have that one. I thought you were going to say Duel of Fates. We have safe rescue, refuge. Not refuge, no. No, we haven't. Which one was refuge? Uh, messenger's gift. I think that's the one we got. Messenger's gift. Mm. Nope. We have neither of those. Okay. So, so I guess it's just doesn't. Twenty-four. Okay. No, we did that. We did that. We have USK's research. Yes. That's the one where we had to kill the Scourge Beast and the minion there at the clinic, right? Yes. Yeah. If you have safe refuge, uh, if you have USK's uh, read 52. This is... Where's 50? I'm missing 53 and 54. Hmm? No. This is funny. And weirdly adorable. What? I'll tell you I'll tell you once you stop recording. Hunter also gains one survivor token where they pick up the consumable space. I'm sorry, what was that? These tokens are lost if the hunter teleports or goes into the dream. Hunter ending move. Whenever we go to a consumable space, these tokens are lost. Uh, hunters gain one survivor token. Wait, I'm confused. Let me. Let me. Or we, need, we need to deliver three survivors to... Uh, to the chapel? No, here. Oh. And we do that by going into the space. Consumables, yep. So, what can you're... Be, can be looted or unlooted, does not matter. So what you're telling me... No, when they pick up consumables, we so get what, a survivor as well. So what you're telling me is... Interact with this, get the survivor... And a consumable. And a consumable, okay. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, I think I know what I'm going to do then. Well, it's now the new turn, so it's your turn. Because mm. apparently you didn't finish your turn despite... No, I did. No, no, I did. Yeah, and then I would have fought the minion. Mm. 
So now it's your turn again. No, now it's the start of the phase. And now it's your turn again. Hmm. Well, we are one away from a reset point. Well, there's also the one right there on the Great Bridge. Yeah, so I'm gonna... You would just, if you discard one to move, and then discard another one to grab it. Discard then... one, move. Discard this one to grab it. So give me a survivor token. Mm -hmm. And I get a fire paper. The NPC token, right? Yes. Uh, we need to remember that one of them is... Yeah, uh, that's... These are NPC tokens. Yeah, those are actual. Those are fights. Yeah, these are, those are fights. We don't do deal with those. Uh, okay. okay. Do you want to use the corpse tokens for now? Not really, no. Okay. And I'm gonna dash. So one, two. Three. Where are you supposed to deliver them? Here. Okay. I'm not gonna deliver one at a time. That's stupid. It's not so much delivering one at a time as. Actually, that's a good point. Surviving is a. We're gonna deliver the one. Yeah. Put the one. Just leave the one in the clinic for now. Yeah, like that. Give me two and. Uh, give me three insight tokens. Thank you. You're welcome. Just to me. You're welcome. And you get that one back because I delivered one. All right, my turn. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna discard one to <laughs> come here. I'm gonna discard another one to loot and grab the survivor. And my consumable, please. You got blood pellet. Yay. Yeah, curse you. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. You gonna do that to me, I'm gonna do it to you. I, I put it right at least within reach of you. Could have handed it. Mm, clear one attack slot with the sweet. And then I'm going to use my last one to dash. Let's see. Could dash this way. It's the only way I can dash, actually. So one, two, three. It's the end of the turn. End of the turn. Dink. Ba bum. I just imagine about what happening. Scourge Beast goes right there. And so just give me a space and that. And so there. Consumable spawns. We there. never went through consumable spawns here. We never went through this one. So does these monsters spawn in right here? Yes. Even though we never went to it? Yes. They are now considered populated. Okay, that's fair. And the minion. Mm -hmm. Alright. Hunter's model. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna discard a card. Mm -hmm. One, two. Mm -hmm. I am going to hit with a swift to do five points of damage, making it a speed two. It's gonna do that, but my trick weapon transforms. Well, you already, if it's plus two damage, it's gonna kill it either way. Well, it's currently faster than me, oh. so I still have to dodge it. Oh, okay. But I don't have any slots to dodge, mm -hmm. so. Do that to dodge it. There you go. And it does five points of damage to it. See, see, notice how it landed in your area. And that's why I'm the beast master right now. 
because I'm a beast? No, because I'm Mr. Beast. Fun I fact. Pass you're gonna, and you're going to loop? I can't. Oh. I don't have any cards. Oh, okay. Card. Teeth. Monsters. Nope. One. There you go. Now me. Mm-hmm. Mm. You know what sucks? What's that? I have no way to heal right now. No, you don't. I'm gonna dash. One, two, three. And I'm going to move. One, two. And then, I'm, and then I'm gonna hit it with a plus one speed attack or dodge uh, for two damage. It's gonna hit you with its special attack. So it's speed two, two damage, stagger stun. Uh, Same speed? Three speed, actually. So mine takes precedence for two damage. Okay. Uh, you still... Do you stagger it or anything? Uh, no. You still take two damage from it? Yep. And can you discard a card? Nope. You take an additional damage. So three damage? Mm-hmm. All right. Okay. That's the end of that. We already hit the reset point, so... No, monster's turn now. No. Oh. Oh, Swinging man. into you. Yeah. Ability. Flip another enemy hunter's mob. Gains plus one speed, plus one food. Special. Uh, three speed... Three wound, stagger stun. I want to in the if I can to the stag the stagger stun, it uh gives deals an additional wound. It still does three wounds. Yes. Three wounds. Mm -hmm. But that the, that additional wound only happens if I'm unable to. No, that is which uh, one is it? That is an effect of the frenzy. It gets plus one speed and plus one wound. To that next attack. That's not oh, the special. Okay. Yep. Okay. So all your mist would do would be get rid of stagger. Because what I was going to do is use my numbing mist to get rid of the ability, where the ability's mm -hmm. additional shit. The ability is there. It cannot be gone rid of. Yeah. 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 Can you dodge it? <sighs> no. What I can do is use my blood vial, Yoska's blood vial to heal two for me. Mm -hmm. So now when he hits me with that, I'll have five wounds on me instead of killing me outright. Okay. There we go. Uh, read me Yosuke's vial for me. On the hunter's turn, heal two. It is not your turn anymore. Damn it, you're right. Uh, so you just straight up die. Yeah. And does the does the survivor go back to where it was? Um. They are just lost. Oh, okay, so they're they. It's like they die then. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna use my Carol Rune to save one Blood Echo as I die. And I am going to get adaptive. Mm -hmm. My turn. No. Oh. Top of the round. No, get to shuffle this again. Yep. Speed three, quick lash. And I outkill it. Before it can do anything. Mm -hmm. Give me. Don't need another blood echo. You're at full? I'm at full. Okay. Um, I killed a hunter's beast with the thing in my bobber. Yep. The, the, the scourge beast. Uh, this one. No? 
No, it's the other this one. This one. There you go. Too many insane cards. Are you sure it is? Yep. Chris, one was the other one. Nope. Insight tokens for the NPC from the Odin Chapel. What's the other one then? The one below. Consumables. Oh, okay. This one is the... The consumable survivor. Uh, Scourge Beast slaying spree. You killed the Scourge Beast. Oh, you took out the... You took out the wrong one. No, I, I killed a Hunter's Mob. Oh, you right. No, you right. You right. I'm done. You right. Dude, I'm exhausted. Leave me alone. Anyways. Monster's turn. Nothing nope. around. Moving. Oh. Looting the chest. Mm-hmm. And... That would get rid of all your cards. You wouldn't be able to move. Moving again. You wouldn't be able to move. Oh. You had two cards left. Nope, you right. Let Elixir block one damage. Nice. There's a survivor. I'm gonna set him on my dashboard. Fair enough. Alright. Monster's turn, nothing there. My turn. Is there anything for landing in the Odin Chapel? No. No? Okay. Uh, however, it would put you closest, closer to the next consumable. That's true. So we can both complete this quest. Yep. Let's go ahead and do that then. I'm drawing my three cards. Let's see. I'm going to go ahead and... Discard that one for one, two. Discard this one. Did you go first this round? No. You went. Did you just not draw cards at the start of the round? I did not draw cards. No. I forgot to. Okay. Don't do that again. I'm sorry. I saw you. And then I'm going to loot. Okay. Keep moving. I can see double. Uh, Molotov cocktail. Yay, I like that. Got another survivor? Uh, yep. Got it right here. And... Keep moving to the clinic. Yeah, I was gonna save this one, but I'm gonna dash. We just left a... We just left a reset point. We're fine. Yeah. Okay. But that does now advance. Draw your cards. Okay, my turn. Yep. One, two. And I'm gonna just discard this card. And you're gonna bring mm -hmm. the survivor? Okay. One survivor remaining. Yep. And then I'm gonna discard this one. One, two. And we've completed that mission. Yay! Reveal card 28. 28. Safe res refuge, Eos Eos the clinic. The shelter at Odin Chapel Insight Mission may no longer be completed. Distribute messenger's gift reward among the hunters. Does that mean we both get it? No. No, but you can choose to get it. Hmm. You can choose or I can choose. It's the messenger's, messenger's gift. Hunter turn. Non-boss enemies do not activate after your turn. That is powerful. That is pretty powerful. How many rewards do you have? Uh, currently four. I also have four. Who's the one that gets into the most trouble with the monsters? Probably me, seeing as how I don't have a way to heal myself. That, and you also don't have anything to stagger them with your shots, so... Yeah, yeah go ahead. Okay, and one of mine, mine has to go away. Yep. Well, yeah. You can either put that one away, or put another one away. In which case do you want? Non-boss monsters don't attack you. Mm -hmm. 
who don't activate after your turn. I don't think we'll really need the Hand Lantern for this game. Probably not. So I'll go ahead and swap that out. Take that and swap out the Hand Lantern. I'm going to take the Messenger's Gift. <clears throat> okay. Now, you can take my survivor, right? My NPC? The, the rules never say anything about not doing that. They just said the only things we cannot share are the stat cards. Okay. Because I want to go into Hunter's Dream, and I don't feel like going back to Odin's Trap to go find him. Yeah, I'll take him. Okay. You turn to the survivor. Stay with, the, stay with him. Zip. And that gets advanced by one. Two, actually, since it's the end of my turn. It's a reset point. That's still there, that's still there, they're all okay, still who's there. the one that keeps not... That, uh, yeah, that's me. Hey, do you mind, uh, you know, staying put and, um, uh, watching over this guy? Uh, yeah, that should be fine, no problem. You disappear. All of a sudden, everything respawns. Uh... Hunter? 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 Hunter! Damn, now I have to actually start replacing cards. You too? Yep. The only thing left that I have been basic is gonna be purples. We're gonna take rallying. That's a good healing card. And actually, we're gonna keep poised. Or we're gonna discard poised, not. I think going forward for the other campaigns, mm -hmm. we should make a rule, home rule, that the hunter who dealt the final blow, or is the one that actually completed the mission, gets first pickings of the rewards. I assume that's what we've been doing anyway. Yeah, but. that's what we've been doing. I'm just going to keep three blood echoes on my side. That way I'm not having to constantly reach in here. One right here. Hey, look, I'm going to swap out a bloodthirsty for a bloodthirsty. Is it a better bloodthirsty? Nope. It's the exact same. So why swap it? Because it's the only thing I can do. Fair enough. Does it say what poison and frenzy do to us? Uh, deals the damage until removed, or makes us go fight the nearest monster. Oh. I don't believe. Very last page. Should be an it. Gain next. one frenzy token. Hunter suffers plus one damage from all attacks. Remove the, to the token when they go into the dream. And poison. Gain one poison token. You suffer one damage at the end of each of their hunter turns. Remove the token when you go to the dream. Your turn. Oh, wait. No, it's my turn. No. It's your turn. Mm -hmm. Draw your cards, though. You know what's funny? What's that? I didn't need you to take the NPC. Ye you're not wrong. You could have literally gone to the dream. The NPC would have gone back to Odin Chapel. You could have respawned at the Odin Chapel. No, actually it doesn't say that it, I need to move. Or it moves. So oh. it just kind of stays there. Oh. Well, probably still better that I do it then. That I stay there with the NPC. Mm -hmm. Alright, well, I'm gonna clear the lane for you. Okay. I'm gonna discard this card. One, two. I'm gonna hit him with a swift four. Mm -hmm. For a speed three. It's gonna do a basic attack. Uh, Scourge piece is at speed three. Mm -hmm. Two damage to you and three four damage. damage to it. Oh, yeah, cool. so you kill it. Yeah. As I said, I'll clear the lane. Anything else you want to do? 
I'm gonna clear off my damage, that's for certain. Refresh my cards, sheesh. Sheesh, sheesh. Okay, but uh, with that, I'm just gonna leave. Okay. Bone Marrow Ash, refresh one reward card. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and discard this one. Come on, buddy. One, one, two. So I'm going to dash with that three. And then, how are you dashing? Can I not? You've been dashing. Because I have a dodge card that says I can move three. Oh, I thought it was just a thing you do. No. Oh. No, I have a dodge card that says move three instead of two. Oh. Oh. Okay. I'm going to use this one to move two more into the Hunter's Mob. And I'm going to hit them with a heavy cleave at speed one plus one damage. Speed one? Uh, you'll take two damage before you kill it. Okay. Ironically enough, after attack, uh, heal no. two. Basic attack. Well, actually, after attack, heal two. So mm -hmm. I lose no. I lose. It doesn't do anything to me, regardless. Mm -hmm. I gain the blood echo, and I killed a hunter's mob with the NPC. You're welcome. Complete the mission when the start has no remaining tokens on. Read card fifty-eight. You're welcome. Thank you, Zandor. You are a very valuable member of this team, Zandor. You are very, very, very useful. Thrill of the Hunt. Distribute one consumable and Carol Rune Hunter among the hunters. Ow. Consumable is Beckoning Bell. One other hunter teleports to your space. Okay. And the Carol Rune Hunter. On attack, attack gains plus one speed. After attack, transform the weapon for free. And then exhaust the card. Mm, that one's pretty powerful. Uh, you know what? I'm pretty. I'm happy with my healing stuff, so I'll take the beckoning bell. I will take the girl room. I will replace it from the claw mark. Which is replace the stat card effects with plus one stagger. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, excuse me. And I have nothing else. Oh, actually, I'm still my turn. Uh, I'm gonna use my beast blood pellet. Hold up. Just to let you know, we have two insight tokens. Okay. And we cannot gain the third one because... Ah! What? Ah! I'm assuming that's what's going to happen. Ah! Anyways, uh, I'm going to use my Beast Blood pellet now. For sure, for sure. For sure, for sure? For sure, for sure, for sure to clear sure, for sure. one attack slot. Ah. Oh boy, the suspense. Oh it's boy. killing me. Oh boy. Remove the contain card from and the fog gates from the own tomb. At the end of each round, if the card beast is not in space with the hunter, it moves four spaces toward the nearest hunter with the lowest HP. How many HP do you have? Two. So, so wait, even to... even though it's not adjacent to us, it still moves? Otherwise it attacks yes. Okay. So otherwise it attacks the hunter with the lowest HP. So it either moves or or swings, is yeah. what it says. Yeah. Each time the cler beast cleric flips a recovery, spawn one scourge beast on it. What? I'm sorry. It does. What? Spawns a scourge beast in its face. I hate the scourge beasts. Discard this card if... We have clearing the pack. We have it active. We have not finished it. Discard the. What was that last part? Uh, once we finish this mission. Uh huh. Hey, bud. It's a reset point.
Good thing monsters don't attack at the reset point. Actually, they do. They don't. It's a surprise. You're shitting. The Scourge Beast does a special attack on me, and I die. But I had nothing to lose, so it's fine. The only thing we have to fear is fear itself. Okay, uh, let's say FDR. They're English, not German. It's, I mean, especially German. German, just because his name is spelled like German, it's pronounced German, and he's also English. Well, uh, I imagine that Yoska is uh, Russian. I will have to check. But anyways, do you want me to click, kill that Scourge Beast? Because I can. Yeah. I can. Yeah. Kill it so we can get rid of more inside tokens. Yep. <sighs> it's gonna hurt when that when that cleric beast activates. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And be sure to get wounded for me. No. One, two. And I'm gonna hit him with adaptive for three damage. Okay, and it's gonna hit you. With a basic attack. And it also staggers, by the way, but because it's a faster attack, I'm going to use my repeating pistol instead. No, it staggers. Pistol staggers. No, but it also has a stagger effect. That will only take effect if you were faster. That's what I'm saying. That's why I'm using my pistol instead. Uh, you for three, three, three damage? Three damage on the Scourge Beast. Okay, does not kill it. Nope. Continuing with combat? Yep. I'm going to do an uh, arcing swing at plus one speed. It's gonna be a special attack, so speed two, your speed three. I kill it before it can do anything. Kills it before it can do anything. No, right here. Give me the monsters. I am the beast master here. And I have no other cards. Okay. Well, I don't like this at all. No, I don't. Oh, the monster, the fire beast activates now. Yep. One, two, three, four. <laughs> You're so close. <laughs> I don't like this female. Now, question, does it activate in phase one or phase two? Because it doesn't say. We did have to bring it down to phase two in order to get into oh, to so the So my two. assumption is, is that it stays in phase two. I would assume the same thing, honestly. Okay. Works for me. That makes it easier for us. And it doesn't say like, oh. Um, yeah, no, I, it, yeah. Read it, read it in its entirety for the. At audience. the end of each round, if the cleric beast is not in the space of a hunter, it moves four spaces towards the nearest hunter with the lowest HP and attacks. Otherwise, it attacks the hunter with the lowest HP in that space and does not move on reset, but instead it heals all and moves all inside. So I would say. What about uh, the setup? It didn't say anything. It didn't say anything? Okay. So I would say it's on phase two. I would say the same thing. took it to phase two, so it only has 12, 12 wounds. It only has 12 wounds. Only. Hey, but we are at the start of reset, so... Actually, well, now we're not, because... Oh, yeah, you just went. Yeah. No! Because I haven't taken my turn yet. Did I go first? Yes, you did. Whoops. Yep. Well, you were in the, you're in the dream anyway, so where do you want to spawn? I would say spawn in the clinic, that way we can both attack this thing. Nope! Phoenix, no. <laughs> no, Phoenix. <laughs> no. Oh, dear God. Watch the first card be a recovery card. I would cry. I would too. I'm going to hit it with a rallying... Deadly thrust. Speed three does five damage. Jumping smash. All hunters in the space must dodge at speed one or s dodge a speed one or suffer two damage and stun. Well, good news for me. I can dodge it. Yep. At speed one. Uh, so what I'm starting to read these as is it is 
that is the speed of the attack. That's where I'm willing to bet to. I'm thinking that's that's what it should be. Is the speed of the attack? It's not the timing. What? Yeah, that was this. Oh, okay. That was my foot. The after what happened here with the mob, a little excited and hoping that this place going crazy. I do wish. I do hope this place is haunted. It's not, but I do hope it is. I could totally mess with you right now, but I'm don't not going to. because. But I'm gonna dodge it. Doesn't matter. Um, which is good for me. Mm -hmm. That does five damage to it, yep. and I'm gonna. I don't know. I'm gonna make it do six damage. Okay. I just brought it to half health, baby. What do you feel like? How do you feel? I feel like the next card is gonna be a recovery card. And I'm gonna hit it with a staggering speed two. Overhead slam speed two, four damage. Targets all hunters in the space before the attack. One hunter in the space may exhaust their firearm to place one insight token on the cleric's beast card, and then the attack deals minus one per insight token. I'm sorry, what does it do? Minus one damage per insight token. Do you want to use your firearm? Nope. For minus one. I'm gonna block one. No, I'll tell you what I do. I will use it to do minus one. I'm gonna block one there you two, go. so that way it only does one damage to me. There you go. And I'm going to refresh my firearm. You don't even have to flip it. And fire it. Okay. That is going to be a slow speed attack. It's going to do that. The stagger stun speed three. So your damn it doesn't even do it. You don't even do anything to it. Move the hunter one space away. Hunter may exhaust their firearm to place one inside token on the cleric's beast card when you already used it to fire on him. Yep. Where do you want to be moved? Here or here? Put me closer towards you. Okay. And I'm going to refresh my reward card and refresh my cannon. Mm hmm. Because I am boned. You are severely boned, yes. That's, oh, that's but scary, by the I way. did. I did. Oh, you brought it. No, you did six points of damage in one turn. That's impressive. Don't get me wrong. You're still boned. Oh, and I healed two from the that, but I only had one. Oh, time, okay. So. okay. I only get to heal one. Yeah. All right. <laughs> Did I not? God, I keep forgetting to draw my cards. Well, no. now it's the next turn. No, I went before you. Yeah. So now I went. I went after you. Yeah. So. so now it's the next. The next turn. One, two, three. Oh, okay. Good dodge card. You want me to go first? You're supposed to go first. The last time was a fluke. Uh, yeah, go first. Do you want to run away? Hold up. What? Oh wait, no. The the bosses don't suffer the effects of the Odin Temple. Never mind. Yes, they do. They do. Mm -hmm. That's supposed to be a speed two. That's a speed one. Oh. You know what? And that means that I can spend this to make it a speed two to match it, so yep. it'll take three points. Yep. So it'll take three three additional points. All right. And I refresh that, so that's it. I did nine points of damage to it. Yep. How does it feel? This is how it feels to chew fuck. <laughs> Don't come on. That's a cringe commercial, and you know it. <laughs> Uh, I am going to go ahead and... Well, now I want to kill it. Hit it with one point of damage. Really? Yeah. Oh, I forgot. Threaded cane. God. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's speed zero at the very least. I still get to draw a card. Please be a bomb. It's a speed... It's a speed zero. Uh, cannot be staggered, but it can be dodged. And, because I just filled up my trick weapon, mm -hmm. I can discard all that, Yep. trick my weapon. I am not going to flip it, I'm going to leave it as You is. have to flip it. Do you? Yeah, you have oh. to use your trick weapon. Oh. And I'm going to put this on the quick lash. Mm -hmm. And now I'm going to dodge it at a speed 2. There you go. 
Yep. Yeah. Right. Doesn't do anything. And now it has how many wounds left? Two. Uh, two wounds left. But uh, hey, hey, bud. Regardless of what happens. Fuck it. All right. Uh, let's 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 uh. What what's another word for that? Puck it. Blast it. Blast it. Blast it. Three damage, recovery, remove block all. two, so it only does one. I'm gonna remove all insect tokens. Yep. So 11 points of damage on him. What else does it do? No, what uh, else is the special? And it summons a scourge beast. scourge beast in the same space. Yep. But we are all in the same space together. No, actually, you were moved by the by the monster. Remember? No. Ah, uh, so I had to be yeah, attacked. Yeah. Me. Okay. Well, it was nice knowing you. Do the. There you go. You got to be able to see the palm of your hand. Well, I'm just gonna go ahead and pull mine now. Actually, I'm. Uh, yep. Yeah, no, I'm just gonna go ahead and pull my character now. Because... No, I, here's what I'm gonna do. It's my turn now, right? I'm done. What? What did you card do? Card I just flipped for its attack. For its attack. Recovery. Move what on. happens on recovery? Shuffle Cleric Beast action deck. Oh, wait a minute. And what does it do? <laughs> <laughs> Here, no, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Actually, it is the monster's turn. And yeah. the Scourge Beast now attack. I was because I was like, no, no, hold on, I can use my beckoning bell. Yeah, it's not your turn. Yeah. Nope. Nope. Nice knowing you. Hey, bud, remember how you gave me the messenger's gift? Yeah. Yeah, you could have used that. Probably. Yeah. All right. No! I have one hit point left. I should not have shuffled that. Automatically dodge an attack. And I just pulled two basic cards, so that means that I'm at five out of six. Okay, so now is it my turn? It's your turn. Come help me. I'm gonna use the beckoning bell to teleport you to me. Not me to you, or you to me. One other hunter teleports to your space. <sighs> okay, fine. Look, do you wanna be faced up against that? Not really. Exactly. Um, okay. Okay. Uh, Question: Are you gonna let come to come to us? I think that that's, that was actually my plan. Yeah. I was gonna say, question: Can I give you the blood vial so you can heal for two? No. Because there's no rule that says I can't. It's only between chapters. That's a bad idea, yeah, you're right. Now, let me let me point out this little blessing. One, two, three, three four. One, two, two. two. Yep. This is fine. This is fine, but you know what? You've man you did a lot of I look my character looks to you. He sees how damaged the beast is. And he just gives you a simple nod. Heavy cleave at plus one speed, plus one damage. Actually, no, wait. Before you have, I, to, move, you have to move into yeah, his space. Yeah, so I'm going to move into his space. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to throw a Molotov cocktail at him for two damage. Killing the beast. No, it wouldn't flip a coin because it's not an attack. Is that on attack or on Hunter's turn? On Hunter's turn. Review this card. The towering beast lets out one final shrill cry before collapsing to the ground. In the distance, howls and cries of scourge beasts now retreating from central Yarnum fill the air. 
On the horizon, the rays of the sun begin to rise, bringing the dawn and marking the end of this long hunt. You know, soon though, the blood moon will rise once more, and a new threat will call you into yet another hunt. Hunt completed. Thank you.